Introverts often misunderstood experience stress in a uniquely personal way. While the world seems to celebrate the outgoing, introverts find solace and comfort in quietude. This preference for calm can make navigating a noisy, demanding world particularly stressful for them. Introverts are not immune to stress, they just feel and process it differently. Imagine being at a bustling party. Music blares, conversations overlap, and laughter fills the air. While some thrive in this environment, introverts might feel their energy rapidly draining. This doesn't mean they don't enjoy socializing, it simply means they recharge in quieter, more serene ways. Understanding this fundamental difference is key to managing stress effectively as an introvert. Instead of trying to conform to extroverted norms, embracing one's introverted nature can be liberating and empowering. It's about working with your natural inclinations, not against them, to find true peace. Introverts often encounter specific stressors in everyday life. These stressors can be subtle yet profoundly impactful. Large social gatherings, constant noise, and a lack of downtime can be overwhelming. The hustle and bustle of daily life can feel like an unending storm. Imagine being bombarded with information, requests, and interactions all day long. For introverts, this can be mentally and emotionally exhausting. It's like having your senses on high alert, leaving little room for peace and quiet. The need for a sanctuary becomes paramount. Open plan offices, while popular, can be a nightmare for introverts. The lack of privacy and constant interruptions can be draining. The constant buzz of activity can make it difficult to focus and concentrate. Finding a quiet corner can feel like a luxury. Similarly, constant notifications and the pressure to be on in our hyper-connected world can lead to digital overload. The digital noise can be just as overwhelming as the physical. Then there's the expectation to be on all the time. The pressure to respond immediately can be suffocating. Social events, Networking functions and even casual interactions can feel draining if not approached strategically. The energy required can be immense. This is not to say introverts should avoid these situations entirely, it's about finding a balance that works for them. It's about recognizing their impact and finding ways to navigate them effectively. Strategies like setting boundaries, taking breaks and seeking quiet moments can make a significant difference. For introverts, solitude isn't just enjoyable, it's essential. It's a vital part of their well-being, a sanctuary where they can truly be themselves without any external pressures or expectations. It's in these quiet moments that they recharge, reflect, and reconnect with themselves. This time alone allows them to process their thoughts and emotions, gaining clarity and insight that might be elusive in a more chaotic environment. Think of it as a battery recharge for the mind and soul. Just as our devices need to be plugged in to function optimally, introverts need their solitude to maintain their mental and emotional health. Just as extroverts gain energy from social interaction, introverts find solace and renewal in their own company. This self-imposed retreat is not about isolation, but about finding a balance that allows them to thrive. Solitude allows for deep thinking, creative exploration, and a sense of calm that's hard to find in the hustle and bustle of daily life. It's a space where ideas can flourish, and creativity can be nurtured without interruption. It's a chance to tune out the external noise and tune into your own thoughts and feelings. This introspection is crucial for personal growth and self-awareness, providing a deeper understanding of one's desires and goals. This doesn't mean locking yourself away from the world entirely. It's about finding a healthy balance between social interaction and personal time, ensuring that neither aspect is neglected. It's about carving out regular pockets of time for yourself, whether it's a quiet evening at home, a walk in nature, or simply taking a few minutes to sit in stillness and breathe. These moments can be brief yet profoundly impactful. These moments of solitude are not selfish, they're an investment in your well-being. By prioritizing this time, you're ensuring that you can show up as your best self in all areas of your life, fully recharged and ready to engage. Introverts have a finite amount of energy for social interaction and external stimulation. This means that their energy reserves can deplete quickly in social settings or during high-stress activities. Understanding this is crucial for managing stress long-term. By recognizing their unique energy needs, introverts can develop strategies to maintain their well-being. Imagine your energy as a bank account. Just like money, your energy needs to be managed wisely. You make deposits through quiet time and solitude which help to replenish your energy levels. Conversely, you make withdrawals when you engage in social activities or take on demanding tasks, 
which can drain your energy. The key to avoiding energy bankruptcy is to be mindful of your spending and saving habits. This means being aware of how much energy you are using and ensuring you have enough time to recharge. If you know you have a busy week ahead, schedule in extra downtime to compensate. This proactive approach can help prevent burnout. Don't be afraid to say no to social invitations if you need to recharge. It's important to listen to your body and mind. Learning to conserve your energy is not about avoiding life. It's about making smart choices. It's about making choices that allow you to show up fully when it matters most. This means prioritizing activities that are truly important to you. It's about setting boundaries, prioritizing your well-being, and ensuring you have the energy to engage in meaningful interactions. Recognizing that it's okay to decline invitations or step away from demanding situations when needed is crucial. This self-awareness can lead to a more balanced and fulfilling life. If you found these tips helpful, please subscribe to our channel, like this video, and share it with others who might benefit. Your support helps us create more content like this.